Hey everybody, my name is Ben. I've re-recorded this intro probably a hundred times. Sitting in my bedroom here sweating bullets because I needed to say something, but I wasn't sure how to and I'm still not. I've been quiet for a long time and the reason I haven't done that isn't because I don't have music to share or things to talk about. It's because there are much more important things for you to be doing right now. I didn't want to add any noise to the signal that Black Lives Matter and the protests around the world are trying to make. The fact is, America and many other countries have a police problem. And that problem is the people that are sworn to serve and protect do neither. They're not held accountable for their actions and they're not provided with any kind of proper training to handle situations that aren't violent. I'm here not because I believe suddenly my opinion is really, really worth anything, but it's because I wanted to play some songs and to bring some attention to you that the protests aren't over. In major cities around the world, there are still people in the streets risking coronavirus and physical harm, trying to talk sense into the system, trying to bring justice where it should have been all along. And so I thought I would use my platform of a couple of hundred people to try and Bring light to those issues. Remind you that those protests are still happening, those people are still in danger, and you are still in danger every time a police officer stops by your house. Maybe not quite so much if you're white, but that doesn't mean <laughs> that things are good yet. So I'm going to play a couple of cover songs, and then I'm going to get the hell out of your face. But um, I thought that that would be something I could do. It would provide a little bit of value. So here we go. My first song is a cover by Pat the Bunny. There's kind of a stigma. Um, about playing those in the folk punk community. Pat the Bunny's kind of a folk hero now, and everybody knows his songs by heart, so playing them is a lot like playing Wagon Wheel. But for this occasion, I thought that this would be appropriate. The song's about building a better future, and it goes out to all of the autonomous zones out there in Minneapolis and Seattle and Ashland and everywhere else where people are trying to make things better where they were really bad just weeks before. Um, keep planting gardens. Keep sheltering the homeless and providing food and shelter and doing all of the things that our system should do but doesn't. Um, the art is beautiful and I can't wait to get down there and help sometime, but till then my money will have to do. Song is called Proud Hunt of Manhattan. I think I already said that. Let's get it started. I stick tape in the holes in my shoes. I stick my tongue in the holes in my teeth. I stick expletives in my thought process When I speak My friends stick to their guns They've got a bunch in the hills of Vermont Till the end times come Well, Saturn says he's gonna learn to live Like the world isn't gonna end And I admire his strength a Mischief Brew song. It's a song that I really love, but it's a song with a really sad story. In 1985, an improvised explosive device was dropped on top of a row house in Philadelphia. That row house held the Black Liberation Group MOVE, founded in 1972. 
I'm reading this off the screen. But that bomb was dropped by police officers from a helicopter. This bomb was authorized by the mayor and authorized by the police department, and it killed many people. As the building went up in flames and continued to burn the buildings around it, the police would not allow firefighters to come in and try to put out the blaze, meaning an entire Philadelphia neighborhood burned at the hands of police negligence. As the fire raised the building, people ran out into gunfire and were cut down by the police. No one was arrested for this, and to this day, no one has been held accountable, not even the mayor. A public apology was issued, but that doesn't bring people back to life. The song is by the Philadelphia band Mischief Brew. Eric Peterson wrote it about how he felt about this time, and I think that it's important to not lose perspective of the past. So I'm going to try to play it and do it justice. We'll see. For this one, i got to sit down. We'll be where the tides are rising In the city of brotherly love The bright red lights were flashing The cellars rose up in a flood And when they drag you from the depths of mud They'll beat you when you were down They toss you in jail for a hundred years Save a city Gunshots roar through the streets And if everyone questioned that liberty bomb Or why the timers were even wound A scolding they'd heard so we soon learned Save the city, you burn it down That's what they said Politicians that they love, or the gavels will crush down on your home, and you'll be expected to applaud. And so the crime was a trip to the market, the sentence a lifetime of hurt. She saw through the tears her home of thirty years reserved to bubble and dirt. She cursed those who would approach her, hold papers up to her face. Say you should feel blessed You live in the U.S. And not just a hellish place <coughs> So take heed if you live in the city In a part where the tourists won't tread Beware if you maintain resistance Choose not to be one of the led And if you're around in suburban gardens Do not let them plant lies in your head Cause you could come home To no home Or find your family dead Cause they've got a dream Of this city Where no community unity Can be found So stand up and say Your neighborhoods Fuck the city Burn it down 